Hey guys, Taylor here from Tauranga Cars and today we're looking at a 2017 Sparu BRZS which is the high spec model. This one's done just under 87,000 k's and as you can see it's nearly perfect. If you come around here and have a look inside I can show you what we've got to deal with on the interior here. But lovely well bolstered seats that hold you in position which you need in a vehicle that's pulling G's in the corners because these things handle like they're on rails. Rear wheel drive chassis with a limited slip differential in the rear. This particular model is the newer facelifted model. It has digital dash which gives you a lot of information about the vehicle. Lovely short throw gearbox with a six speed in it. We've got excellent climate controls. The interior feels highly premium and what you can see here is it's very very compact. So even though there's rear seats you may or may not be able to fit somebody in it. I mean, you be the judge of that, really. Nice to have. If you wanna, wanna stash things in the back, you can actually fold them flat as well. You've got a reasonably good sized boot here with a, quite a nice low profile spoiler on it. Yeah, good touring vehicle for you and your partner or whoever it is that you wanna take on the open road. And they're certainly a lot of fun to drive. We've got a two liter direct injection flat four in this one, boxer engine, co-developed with Toyota on this particular vehicle. Sitting on good Michelin primer seat tyres all round, 17 inch alloys as standard, 215 width. This one here has the track mode that you can add to it, um, add an extra level of fun. And um, when you pop it in track mode, it disengages the traction control and sharpens everything up a little bit. You can get the car to turn quite well in corners. It doesn't like to step out and spin, but it certainly does like to bring you round a little bit more than you would if you're just driving it conservatively. Um, under the bonnet, as I say, we've got the two litre engine in this. They're very nice little motors. Being a, being a joint venture with Toyota, Subaru created this BRZ, Toyota created the 86. They put a flat four in it, below centre of gravity. So it actually sits below the top of the suspension top hats here. That low centre of gravity and their 50-50 weight balance creates an intensely exciting experience, especially when you're driving very spiritedly. Better to do it on the open road, country roads, but certainly around town it's very usable. This one's got the LED headlights and uh, we think it's quite a fun car and certainly uh, in very good condition so jump inside with us we'll go for a drive so this is the interior of the brz i'm gonna do, do a little drive up the road in it so you've got push button start carbon fiber sort of accents all about you've got a very nice steering wheel with steering wheel controls this has also got cruise control in it you've got the traction control button you've got the track mode track mode makes it a lot more fun doesn't make it too much more dangerous if you know what you're doing so we're going to set off now for a little drive such a lovely gearbox in these as well especially this one it's very 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 tidy um, in general this car so with near 50 50 weight distribution what it creates is a, a very balanced car that's quite happy to turn into corners and you can hold the car in a corner at higher speeds than you think is probably acceptable it just really grips the road and if you want it to, it can step the ass out. If you want it to. It'll hold the grip. It's got a nice exhaust note on it. This is a factory exhaust in this one. When you really beat on it, it opens a valve into the cabin. Allows you to actually hear the exhaust sound a lot better. Downshift's quite enjoyable in this car, especially if you can heel toe. And yeah, a great value driver's car really, something to get excited to get into at the start of the day and something that you look forward to driving home at the end of it. And you may stand around with a beer in your hand in the driveway, admiring the beauty of it as well. Cheers guys, see you next time eh?